Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 with me, Grey Hunter. where last time we were trying to get claims on the rest of Sardinia. We've already got a claim on Arborea, and we still have to get one on Cag Cagliari. I don't know, it Italians know how to pronounce that. I'm just like, whatever, it's an Italian place. So hopefully we can capture that. Or at least get a claim on it, and then hopefully we'll be able to take out bits of du jour Italy and add another kingdom to our crowns. That'd be pretty cool, I reckon. We also picked up last time the Kingdom of Heaven, or Jerusalem, and we'll need to pick up the uh, remaining little bits of that, but I'm not sure if we'll be able to for a little bit, because there's a host claim on Egypt. Currently it's in the, uh, the claimant's favour, so hopefully there'll be rebellions, but I just don't know. There's also a peasant revolt for Asuf, but the current sultan is winning that one. I don't know. We shall see. So we've got a title loss on succession of Sicily and Scotland, because we have still got ourselves betrothed to the empress. I've changed my mind about that. It would be cool, but then we wouldn't be able to snap up bits of the Holy Roman Empire, because she would technically be a close relative and all that other stuff. So. She won't like us, but she can get fucked. Alrighty. So, currently we are unmarried. Let's see if we can get someone with good stewardship. Someone youngish. Uh, we could get this nice German lady. She... Ooh, she's Midas Touch, so she's got a bonus to, f to fertility. She's greedy, though. She's not chaste, so that's a definite plus, and she's got good stewardship. Can we get someone a bit more balanced? Hmm. Not really. She seems like a good choice. She's 19, and she gets us an alliance with Baron Rudolf of Tecklenburg, so... I don't know, an alliance is good, I guess. This lady... might be better, though. She's lustful. And Midas touched. Yeah, she's better. Who do... oh, we get a... really, with a bishop? Whatever. Marry her. We've got a bit of prestige that we can afford to burn because creating the uh, title Kingdom of Jerusalem gives you 5,000 prestige, I believe, and 2,000 odd piety. Or maybe it's 5,000 and 5,000. I don't know, but let's get married. Uh, we got that as our... Yes, we do. We've got that as our goal. And we're currently fighting the King of Lyon. Though I don't know that we really have to do all that much. I am going to raise our personal levies, though. So let's raise our personal levies and only ours. And march these guys all over here. And boats. Boats. Actually, we'll sail everybody. Everybody made up in Evru, and we'll borrow your boats. You guys need to all march there. Ships need to go there. And I don't really want to lead this one myself, so we'll get this fella to lead it. Does that put us at home? No, it gets us leading troops in Azerbaijan? What? Oh, it put us in charge of um, our retinue that's coming home. Could we not? Because that would be nice. Oh, right, because I moved out that fella. I swapped with him. So let's put Hubert in charge. Nope. Gerard. There we go. Now we're at home. Much better. Okay. So hopefully our retinue will get home fairly quick. Uh, we can get money or we can get... Prestige. Let's get Prestige. Hooray! There we go. And now we are married. And now we can pick a new ambition. And our ambition will be to have a son. And hopefully her ambition will be to have a son too. Alright. So how many troops here? 4,500. We might need more boats. Let's uh, raise all of the boats. Excellent. You need to move over here to Evru. And continue. So it's 1340 almost, and I'm hoping that the next uh, few decades will go through fairly painlessly. Oh good, great, good job. Because it would be cool to um, actually end the game and start EU4. I probably won't be doing a, uh, a let's play of that. I may, but I don't know, it's very time consuming, so... 
Perhaps, perhaps not, is about the best I can do for you. Though people have been saying, how come you don't want to do one? And it's not that I don't want to, it's just that it's very time consuming. It's a paradox. They're always time consuming. Hmm. Do I want to create this? You know what? Why not? Yeah. And we'll give it to this fella. So hopefully he'll be happy with the two places he has. There you go. You're now the Duke of Galilee. Galilee? Alright. Much better. Now, let us go to war. Hello. Artel's host. Artel. How the hell is there a Castile again? Is my question. And who is Artal? Oh, Artal Jemina. Jemina. Jemina? He's fighting... Who? He's fighting some baron. <laughs> He's fighting some baron for his title. Nice. Solid effort there, dude. Alright. Let us go ashore. And start besieging the crap out of this guy. Hello? Uh, where are his actual armies? Oh, down here. Very good. Let us march to here, to Salamanca, and then to Badahoff. Where are we going? Badahoff. I'm pretty sure I made that reference already in this LP. Um, yeah. Dismiss the boats. We don't need to worry about them. Yeah, whinge, whinge, whinge. Boats. I had them. Uh, the Duke of Anjou is dead. It's interesting. Apparently we had a holding in Azerbaijan. Empress Ingrid has had a hairstyle change. It's good. It's nice. Uh, hopefully we have a son. Because that would be nice as well. No title loss would be fantastic. What do we... I don't know. It says that we owned something, but we couldn't have. We didn't. I don't know. Whatever. A limb died. Bedridden and infirm. Is he? Oh, he's one of the eunuchs that we got gifted. Good for him. He lived a long time. Really? The Waldenesian heresy has appeared. Where? Vienne. Where's Vienne? Oh, here. Really? You a heretic? No. He's trying to kill your wife. Alright, well, let's proselytize here instead. Huh. How about that? Now, what are you guys fighting for? Some princes claim on the Holy Roman Empire. Okay, what about you? The Latin League Independence War. Really? And he's going to win. Huh. How about that? Duke William of Ulster has declared an, a war on King Bishop Morgan of the Isles. We just like beating up the King Bishops, I think. Hmm. Well, whatever. Oh, there's two different armies there. Really? Who are you? I have no idea, but we're going to get there in time to stomp both of them. I think. Yeah. Get the hell down. River crossing. <laughs> Whatevs. Okay. Kick the crap out of them. 48% only. Really? It's not as good as I thought. I, would, I was hoping that we'd do a bit better than that. Whatever. Kill. Ooh. The Count of Leptis Magna has died, and finally, they have no claims on our land. Good. Good. Okay. Died of an infected wound, apparently. And there should be a thing saying that he didn't get any of our stuff. Yes, he did not get the claim on... The Empire or the Duchy of Sicily. Hooray! And the Pope has declared war for... Really? You go, Pope. 
I can't help him with this one, because it's technically not a crusade, I don't think. Unless I can. Can I offer to help him? No. Nope, I cannot offer to help him. Well, he might win. I hope he does. That'd be cool. Um. Right. Well, let's just go over there. See if we can't kill some more of these guys. Really, the war should be over, I would have thought. But apparently, I thought wrong. Auto saving? No! You are slowing me down with my gaming. Alright, well, that army is dead. So let us continue on. 54%. Artol. Artol? I thought Artol won already. Maybe not. Mendo's claim on Toledo. Is that a war that you started? You did, didn't you? You did, you bitch. I should have just said whatever. Have fun with that. Ah. Um. Well, is he? No, he's not. I'm sure he's not a heretic. Quit complaining. Uh, you're going to Zamora, so will I. Alright, now hopefully if I attack like this, I can get him. 16th of March, 13th of March. No! 18th, 20th. No! Alright, let's go kill this guy instead. Yes, go like that. Mayor Hamlin has been imprisoned. Duke Radolf has in inherited a county. Fulk of Paris died in bed. Oh, and Camilla, you... you Ubaid? Ubaid? Died in my dungeons. There's going to be a few more people dying in my dungeons before this is all over. Okay, you are dead. Duke Hamo of Jerusalem has been, ex has been excommunicated. Really? Do you stand to inherit anything? Who is his heir? No, his heir is me. His heir is me. Why bother doing that? I don't know. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but who knows? Maybe it does to somebody else. Maybe to Pope Mark and King Serlo it makes some sense, but I, I don't get it. Well, seeing as I've got the power to do so... Is that him? No. There we go. Duke Hamo of Jerusalem, I will lift your excommunication. Because I am a good ruler. Are you winning your war? No. The Pope is getting his ass whooped. But see, it's... I guess I can't press his claim because he's not technically part of my... Area? I don't know. Can I... Can I press his claim? I have valid reason to declare war, but I cannot declare war with raised levies. Oh, hello. You've gone independent, have you? Now that is a damn shame. You should never have done that. Can I declare war on you? Again, yes. Who is your heir? Okay. Seems like it might be time to duck out of this war, because really, we're, they're doing fine. They don't need my help. They don't need my assistance. Good. Alright, come on, get home. There you go. Done. Okay, is there a truce breaker thing for attacking her again? Uh, no. Really? Okay. Um, I would like to declare war, please. Thanks. She does just own this one spot, right? No vassals of any kind, no. Okay, she does just own this one spot. Good. You are going to lend me your troops. You are going to lend me your troops. I say lend, I mean give. Uh, where's the Duke of Upper Burgundy? There he is. Yes. Gimme. And the King of Aquitaine. Gimme. 14,000 men should be enough. I say should. You can give me yours as well. And you give me yours. There we go. Alright. Let's roll. Actually, what are you fighting for? You're fighting for... 
Another claim on the Holy Roman Empire. For a baron. Okay. And these guys are declaring war against somebody as well. The Holy Roman Emperor. <laughs> In the fourth Mongol invasion. They just I, I hope the Timurids show up and ruffle stomp these fools because it's getting really, really, really irritating. Having them just sort of like just swarming across the map. They didn't do this. They never lasted long enough. When the Khan died, everything went to shit. Not so in this Paradox game. But it would have been nice. Binhild Salian. Okay. Whatever. I don't care. Come on. Get over there. We can call in allies. Nah, we don't need her. Would be nice to pick this up, though. And plane! Go away! Yes, yes, I know. Stephanie de Heddingham is no longer the guardian of Mortil de Harcourt. Well, I guess I could be her tutor. Could I not? I could. There we go. Hooray! Oh, you're turning out okay. Cool. Come on, everybody, get over there. Over there. We need to fight before they decide that no, they don't really want to be in this rebellion. Measles have broken out. No! Measles are bad. People have died. I'm assuming from the measles. And depression, apparently. Uh, people have been released from prison. Hooray. Don't care. This is all of my care. There is none. Really? Why are you... Oh, right. War to uh, remove his title thing. That makes sense. <clears throat> <clears throat> we can assault now, but I want to wait until all the men are there. Come on. Give me those 3,000 more swords. Come on. Come on. Get there. Go, 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 go. Smallpox is broken out. That's swell. It's only 23% in his favor, so we should be able to... Really? Why the hell not? It's good to be emperor. Damn straight. I need a son. Don't judge me. I need a son. It's not my fault. Kill. Kill. Typhus is broken out in Tyrone. Whatevs. And come on. Last one, last one. We've got this. We have got this. Hooray. Now, surrender. Victory. Great. I love it when a plan comes together. Now, we need to find somebody <clears throat> who is male. Search all of them. Male. Not, not, not. Mine. Yes. Adult. Stewardship me. You are heir to the Grand City. Okay, that, that immediately makes you a no-no. You are ambitious. Also a no-no. You are designated heir of Seagrave. Nope. You are not of my culture. It says you are, but it's lying. Now we need a Norman. You are the steward of Pisa. Okay, uh, change this married thing to any... One second thoughts. You're the Marshal of Shrewsbury. Are you the heir to anything? No, you don't even have a claim on anything. And you're a genius. I like you. Congratulations, you are getting promoted. There you go. You are now the Count of Saluzzo. Congratulations on your promotion. Go. Alright, so... <clears throat> did we have any claims on anything else? Uh, first, we'll dismiss these troops. Yes. Were we able to declare war on this fellow? We can claim the county of Rome for Doge Bernard of Capua. No thanks. Um, how's your war going? Are you winning? No, it's sixty percent. <laughs> it's sixty percent in favour of Duke Michael. But he's also defending against some host in the conquest of Bosnia. Maybe they're, maybe they're related? 
Yeah, he's the uh, Peter's brother, Theodore's father-in-law. Right. Okay. Fair enough. This fella, on the other hand. Wow. Wow, they are losing hardcore. I think. I don't know, that could be from any number of wars. But, um... I'd be interested to see... Who the hell are you? How the hell are you a single county independent? I have no idea. But I'd be interested to know... Can we declare war on this fella for that? Uh, for Lucania, is it? Yes, it is Lucania. I would like to do my de jure claim on the county of Lucania. We can. Swell. Uh, first we need boats then. So, give me all of your boats. And give me all of your boats, because I need to row, row, row my boat. Yeah. Huh. There is a, there is a lot of Mongol people over here. What are they doing? They are defending against the Chief of Damascus in the war against the tyranny of Archpriest Ajay, the first of Damascus. And they're also fighting another Old Tengri Revolt. The ninth. The ninth Old Tengri Revolt. Uh, it'd be hilarious if that guy actually had any chance of winning. Are you in rebellion? You are not. But... I can do holy wars. I can't holy war for the whole lot. Are they split over two duchies? They are, of course, split over two duchies. Hmm. Apparently you're not healing much over there. Kurak is not a great place for you. What about here? Yes, there is fantastic. Um, hmm. Well, I think we'll have a quick holy war while we wait for the boats. Declare holy war for Ascalon. Oh. Oh, okay, right, because it's just your part of Jerusalem. Um, yeah, yeah, let's do that. Holy war me. Yeah, I know, you're not happy about my stuff. Whatevs. This is how much I care. Come on, get over there. Besiege! Besiege! Oh! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! The assassins! No! Uh, if you're too close to their, their uh, places, they will try and kill you. Uh, proselytizing... Yeah, Kerak, that's fine. I wanted to send you to Jerusalem, but whatever. Uh, my wife Ingrid had complained about me being so ab being absent so often. I will purchase her a cameo of myself. Yeah, cameo of myself. I'm not quite sure how that makes her feel better. I would have thought the jewelry would be a better option, but shows what I know. Anyway, come on, come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one, one, none. Hooray! Hmm, that is an army up there that I don't like the look of. We shall have to do this quickly. Which is what she said. Hmm. Come on, conquer. Great, we got a prisoner. Another person to die in our dungeons because I just don't give a shit. Good. Prisoner. Um, will you surrender yet? No. No, you won't. I'm not entirely sure why. But whatever. I'll just have to go kill you. Seed is planted. Get over there. Yeah, let's see you run. Oh, you're not going to run? It's going to be a bad day for you guys. Yeah, that whole mountains thing doesn't doesn't faze me in the slightest. Are you willing to surrender now? No, you're losing, but you won't give up yet. You are a damn fool. I will conquer these places from you. Yes, I will kill these troops as well. This is what your foolishness has bought you, you fool. 
Oh, now you're willing to surrender. You idiot. Yes. Alright. Done, done. Done, done. Anyone good from this lot? Eh, you're okay. What about him? Mm, no, the other guy's better. Congratulations, you are going to be the Count of Accra. There you go. And before you bitch to me about, yes, I know, he is technically your dude. Actually, hmm. Hmm. No, I'm going to... Oh. I'm going to educate you as well. Apparently, my mother was doing a really, really good job and made you Swedish. Um, I'm going to hold on to that, actually. I can transfer him the vassalage as a, uh, a token when our next ruler comes up to make him more happy. So combine those and we'll sail for here and then we'll board ship there. Now, are you... Yeah, you're still a kid, so you shouldn't be able to get too much support to fight me. Yeah, this is what it's come to. Taking candy from children. On the 27th of April. Come on, hurry up. Get there. He's inherited the barony of St. Samuel. Well, that's okay. There we go. Alright. Board ship. Gotta sail over here. And while we're here... Hello. We are going to have a war. Now, hopefully he doesn't come for my soft underbelly, because he might. Hell yes, do it. Good job, dude. Solid effort. We will declare war on Pisa soon enough. Um, actually, are they fighting anybody? For Ghana, they are. Um, do I want anything else from this lot? Yeah, yeah. Uh, go here. Pretty sure Medina is another... Yeah, we own the other bit of it. So, do that. What are you guys fighting for now? Are you still fighting for the same thing? What are you fighting for? Oh, okay, right, you're fighting that. Yeah, you've got a truce because you won the war. Okay. Good, good, good. I just like to know how things are going. Duke William has inherited the Barony of Dunless. Well done. Good job. Um, let us take this place. Hopefully, if we just conquer it, he'll be like, yeah, okay. It seems my dalliance has resulted in a child. Thankfully, Baron Golfred thinks little Adeline is his. Oops. <laughs> well, I wanted a son, not a daughter, so you've done it wrong, lady. You've done it wrong. Yes, it is all your fault. Alright, kill. That's how we do war. Are you willing to surrender? Come on, you pansy. Really? That's the best you've got. Alright. Alright, we're coming for you. I will start landing troops on your coast, and I will start rampaging up there. It's gonna happen. You're fighting a war against who? Against Hakon. Huh. That'd be pretty cool if he won. How does he have... Oh, that's not Jerusalem. It looked like Jerusalem. I was like, wait, what? How does he have a claim on Jerusalem? He's some random guy. It's because he doesn't. It just looked like he did. Attack! Yes, this is where you die. Willing to surrender now? No. Okay. Okay, then. I'll just have to kill you. Queen Maya Sant 1. Good job. Finally! Hooray! Alright, kill. The siege lengthens my ass. The siege is over. Alright, are you willing to surrender now? Still no. Okay then. Uh, good job, Ormory. Oh, he's charitable. I was hoping he'd be lustful. I'm more hoping that he'll be Norman. Prince Yvonne. My sister has become an intricate webweaver. Good for her. She is not happy because she's a title claimant. Right. Um, hmm, I'm going to hold on to that. I might try to marry her off to the Basilis, but I'm going to have to wait until we've won our war. So 75%, are you willing to... God damn it. Wait, he's the one? 
The Mysticos. What's the Mysticos? And how the hell is he Imperial? God damn it. Ah, I set designators in there that said that they couldn't have one, but no. Apparently they can. 